So in the past couple of days I've been obsessed with the idea of trying to make a tsunami on Blender. And as you probably guessed already, this has been a quite an enjoyable experience. Like, why? Why are you like this? Because you used the Vault Cube instead of sacrificing it to me. Oh, okay, that's actually fair. Basically, for doing the tsunami, I needed a way to not have to simulate the whole ocean, just the interactions of the ocean with land. I'll explain it better on the tsunami tutorial, if I ever finish the tsunami tutorial, but I use the ocean modifier for the bulk of the ocean simulation thing, easy enough. But doing the actual wave was way more complicated. I tried to use the wave modifier like any sane person would try, right? But it doesn't work for this case, because there's a lot of like tiny values and stuff and it's quite limited, honestly. You can't animate the shape of the wave very well. And I tried a lot of things. I tried like putting drivers into the values and uh, tried to calculate them over time. And I tried to like use an animated displacement map and then it clicked for me. Why am I using wave modifier when I could use the curve modifier and just draw the shape of the wave with a curve and then use curve shape keys to animate the curve over time? So that's that's it. You can use the curve modifier instead of the wave modifier and just animate the curve going one direction and boom, you got your wave. Now for some tips. First, increase the render resolution of your curve or else your render will look like this. The ocean is being distorted by your curve and if your curve is low resolution, smooth it out, increase the resolution. Second, you will, you will, you will, you should align. <laughs> I can't stop. <laughs> Make sure your curve is flat in this direction and for good measure, align it with one of the world axes and one of the sides of your ocean. If your curve is tilted in any way, this will happen. That's it. If you liked this video, give it a like. If you disliked it, well, I'm sorry YouTube recommended you this. But hey, don't forget to tell me in the comments that you already knew everything I said and I am doing a tutorial on something that everyone knows. And also subscribe because there might be a tutorial about doing a tsunami as soon as, as I figure out how to do a tsunami and also edit the video because it's, it, it's gonna take a while. <sighs> Bye.